Hey guys, this is Colleen, and I'm here with another tutorial. This is going to be two ways to make the same thing. Um, widescreen effect. With the black bars, um, you know that effect. Uh, I'm going to show you two ways, and um, one is not complicated, but you got to do more stuff to get the effect. The other way is much more simple. Um, so yeah, let's get to it, and let's go. So the first thing you want to do is you want to put your uh, video clip on the timeline. What I'd like to do is I, if I just need to use the video or the audio, I right click, bring it down, let go, and I go to video only, across tracks. Perfect. Alright, now for this method, I'm going to make another video clip, or excuse me, video track, and then I like to highlight this that way. I'll show you. I'm gonna go to generated media. Uh, go to solid color. All right. Okay. Now it's covering the whole dang video clip. What we gotta do to fix that is go to compositioning mode. Now we have to go to multiply mask, and then there you see it. The video is fine. You can see it. Now, we go to the video clips pan and crop. Um, now you hold, press and hold down control and move the boxes for the video or for the black bars. And set it to however you want. Ta da! There's your black bars. Alright, for method two, you bring down your video just like I showed you before, right click, drag it down, video only, cross tracks. There you go. Now for this one, all you need is to go to event panic crop, press and hold control, and move your boxes and wherever you want the block bars to be. Right there is fine. Um there's also another way to get the black bars. Um hit switches and then maintain aspect ratio go back to your pan and crop and then keep down the control key once again and move the, the little boxes here downward and that way you don't lose any of your video clip uh, if you don't mind that crunch kind of look feel uh, I don't mind it this is what I prefer to do um, so yeah, there's your two methods on how to get your um, widescreen black bars. Um, if you like this, don't forget to comment, don't forget to subscribe, and like, and share, and all of that jazz. Um, if you want me to do a tutorial on a specific thing, let me know, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!